Hey, hey, hey. Oh, let me get myself in there. Hey, hey, hey. It is, of course, Friday. And this is your soul boss. Uh, no. It's the Boss Queen Morning Show. But it's also your soul abundance channel. Okay. Now, I hope you are amazing. It is beautiful um, outside my, my hair. You know when you're having a a bad hair day and I know I'm all like playing with my hair a lot but it's just I need to cut that's what it needs I need a haircut people and so my friends like you always play with your hair on Facebook and I'm like well what can I say hey darling what can I say like it's annoying me so I need a haircut so I'm getting a haircut later on today um, so hashtag first real problems out of the way um, and so just to reframe then so obviously you're getting 10 15 minutes of soul love soul truth from me around the topics of manifestation manifestation general manifestation and mindset and of course a sprinkle of marketing because I believe that every woman has the infinite potential and the inherent power to create that her own queendom according to her own rules so good so passionate about that and today I want to talk about the topic Woohoo! I love it. Um, today I want to talk about the topic, um, choose progress over perfection so you can get over your analysis paralysis. Oh yeah. Okay. Cool words, right? Progress over perfection so you can get unstuck, get out of this um, analysis paralysis. What do I mean? Well, guess what? It's Friday. And I don't know about you, but it's been a good week. It's been a full on week. And I love the fact that I have the freedom to do as I choose. And yesterday was a day where I kind of like um, didn't do as much because Wednesday was very energetically full on. When I say not so much, I mean, it still is a lot, I guess, for other people. But I mean, it's not about who cares? Like, you know, it is whatever it is to you. All I'm saying is ultimate freedom is about understanding you have the ability to show up as much or as little as you want, what feels right. Because at the end of today, it's all about soul guidance. And on some days you feel super, super, super productive. And on other days you want to feel like maybe you need to fill up your own cup, like fill up your own cup. And I had that yesterday. So I took a few hours and chilled and replenished and read my book on law of attraction. There it is, that big fat book. Actually, you can't see it on Instagram. So I will show it to you here. This is the book I'm reading right now. I mean, it's only a few pages. <laughs> I feel like such a nana lying in bed going, right, oh, shall I read a few lines before I go to bed? Okay, let's do that. Um, so it's still, you know, feeling, fueling my mind with good things. Um, and so I think today, like, you know, the, the mindset could be, oh, it's Friday. I'm kind of tired. It's been a big week. And I'm like, well, at the end of today, you don't get to choose I feel like what day it is like I feel like you shouldn't live your life according to what day of the week it is I think you should live your life um, and, and get out there and do your thing according to your soul's calling so what so if you want to do work on a Sunday you do work on a Sunday if you feel like doing nothing on Wednesday and going to the beach and do fuck all then so be it because that's freedom and remember I talked about this yesterday I talked about the fact that forget the money for a moment forget the money because the thing is what do we want it's the feeling behind the money that we want and that is freedom so if you get give yourself permission to feel freedom to trust soul and yes soul is not gonna say to you just like Netflix and chill all the time soul is gonna like today soul is like man you you got things that you need to get out and we're organizing things in our background systems like I'm talking to my VA I'm getting assistance on leveraging some programs as we are streamlining and I'm like oh it's doing my head in but I also know it's so good it's outside my comfort zone but I need to do it because my mission is to impact you know millions in order to do that I've got to leverage some of the things that I do which means yes doing things that outside of my comfort zone today's gonna to be full on day Tomorrow's probably going to be quite a busy day, but I'm also heading out to the beach. So freedom means not having to work all the time. Freedom means to, like I said, really tune in what your soul, soul wants you to do. And here's the thing, though, the flip side of it being you may think that, oh, but I'm so tired because I feel like I've done a lot of work already and I get to rest in my laurels. Well, that's your decision. I'm not here to say to you, this is what you have to do because there's no prerequisite to becoming wealthy. There is no rules as how much you need to do. Really, ideally, you want to know that every day you wake up with an intention and you go to bed with satisfaction and you really, you know, throw everything at it, whatever that means to you. Really important. 
Now, the flip side of that is that I feel like sometimes we can get in this moment of, oh, there's so much I want to do, though. And even though I'm a bit tired, but I really got to put on, like, I've got to push on and, you know, push harder. And I'm like, well, here's the thing. What if you just gave yourself permission to, to, to choose progress, just to choose doing whatever feels good at the moment? You know, don't think about having to put, do all the things, all the things, all the things. Don't worry about having to do all the things perfect because I actually think that the biggest problem is is not that people take too much action. I think it's because people don't take enough action because they think that they have to get it all perfect and there's certain things I've got to wait for the perfect time to post. You know, like stuff that like who is like what is the, the best time to post like you know what like yeah maybe um lunch time is kind of cool but i don't have a set time all the time because i hate having set rules right so um like i said i think sometimes you know you wait for the perfect condition you wait for the perfect time you need to have the perfect picture you need to have the perfect copy you need to have this perfect branding this perfect this and you cannot press play and do this until everything is ready and then it's like oh but energetically i've got to feel ready and i'm like well welcome to the jungle people welcome to the jungle it is just about showing up just about showing up and choosing progress over perfection so what so i don't have this perfectly you know nailed it yet because you know i'm streaming on facebook and instagram and so I'm like, oh, you know, like, do I look only in this camera or do I look in this camera or do I look here and here? And like, who, who cares? Like, you know what? Like, who cares? I'm putting the message out there and I trust that whoever needs to hear it is going to hear it. And they're going to resonate with the energy and with my love and with the intention and the care that, that I put behind this. So what? So I'm looking here and here and, you know, it's, you know, getting it done. Exactly. It's about getting it done. It's about giving yourself permission to show up and just put yourself out there. You know, put yourself out there. Put your message out there. Put your services out there. Put your values out there. Put your why out there. Put your stories out there. Put your challenges out there. Put your milestones out there. Celebrate. Put your reflections out there. And put, and then just repeat again. Just put yourself out there every single day, sharing your message creating content, adding value, letting people in, letting people in on who you are, what you stand for, what triggers you, what resonates with you, what is your why, you know, what connects you, you know, how you live your life, give them an insight. Like, you know, I share a lot about my private life and you will also get always the kind of energy that I am. So sometimes I cry, sometimes I'm quiet, sometimes I'm in like full on preacher mode and most times I don't know like I'm just upbeat but I know that 100% of the time I am myself and I'm showing up and I'm showing up as me and I say you know screw perfection you know like yes it's great and it's nice to have pretty pictures and to do photo shoots and but sometimes I feel like people get caught up on that trying to make you know all my Instagram feed needs to look like this I'm like oh come on like really I don't know I mean this is just me I don't know, it's my opinion that I'd rather get my content out there than worrying about having the perfect freaking, you know, setup of pictures. I mean, it's nice and it looks nice. I know Instagram is also very visual, but at the same time, I also know people who have hundreds and thousands of followers and don't even make any money. And then I have people, I know people who have two, three thousand followers and are killing it, right? Because they are choosing to show up nowhere, no matter what and getting it done. Okay, so stop getting stuck in over analysis you know paralysis where it's like trying to overcomplicate things and then because you're trying to overcomplicate things it's making you stop you know it's making you hold back it's making you you know self-sabotage and procrastinate it's making you move things aside until there's a better time well what i mean if not if now is not the best time then you know oh but then you hear oh but it's already fired i've already done so much and i'm so tired and my kids are doing this and you know like i could come up with all possible excuses of why but i don't do that because i'd rather focus on the excuses why i want to get it done because i know every day matters to me every day i am um, you know i feel i don't know if it's the right word but i feel obliged myself every day to to do whatever feels good to me. I'm obliged to myself to serve, you know, my soul's calling to do the work, but also do the things that freaking light me up. And that is to live life, okay? And I believe you can have it all because that's my message. I believe that you can have it all. 
on your own terms. You get to design this live, this freedom live on your own terms. But you've got to have the balls and you've got to have the courage to actually, you know, get clear on those rules. And you can't get clear on those rules if you're not ready to break them. If you're not ready to throw yourself out there, if you're not ready to like fully leap you know, take a leap into the unknown, stab in the, in the dark until it becomes light. You know, do things even though they're uncomfortable and you're not sure if they're going to get the results. Like I show up every day now, like I had a, probably a couple of days where I didn't show up and that's cool too. But every day I'm doing the Boss Queen show in German and in English and you know what? And it will serve. It will serve people. And so what? So there's not hundreds of people on here live, but you know what? Give it three months, six months, maybe a year, and there will be. I'm doing it because I'm not expecting hundreds of people to be there. Of course, I'm going to be delighted when it gets to that point. And there's no reason why, you know, there can't be hundreds of people tuning in at this given time because, you know, why not? But at the same time, I'm not going, oh, well, I better test different times all the time to make sure I get it perfect. Oh, and maybe I'm not getting the results yet that I want. So I might, it's not a good thing. No, show up every day. The consistency of showing up every day is going to get the job done. So give yourself permission to show up every day. Get yourself out there. You know, show up. Just show up. And if you do that every day, you cannot fail. You cannot fail if you show up every day. That's the message of today. Like, choose to show up no matter what. I don't care what day it is of the week. I don't care what time it is. I don't care what people say to you. You know, like, I've heard people say, oh, you work too much. You're too full on, you know. And I'm like, no, you know, actually, I don't work too much. I do whatever feels right. And maybe on some days, I work a lot. On some days, I don't. And who cares? I don't have to justify myself to anyone because I love what I do. And I, this is my, my purpose is the biggest thing in my life. I rate this above everything my work is my thing you know what and i would choose this over hanging out with people mindlessly you know or doing things that i'm like oh well because you really need to i don't know i don't know do certain things i'm like no no i do my things you know that this is so important to me i do it on my terms and i trust that the right people will be drawn to it, the right people will benefit from it, the right people will get the love, the inspiration, you know, get triggered to think and lean into and hopefully, you know, act upon the bits that I share and it will change their life. And then amen, because then collectively we can make this world so much more freaking juicy and exciting and prosperous and, you know, more abundant and a, and, a, and, a, and a rich life full of freedom for so many more people because you don't need to struggle anymore. There's no need to struggle, but it's, you know, but that's a whole nother story. Story that I will say for another time. So in the famous words, give yourself permission to be, do and have it all on your own terms because permission is granted. Okay. And I know that as long as you tune into the show, you're tapped into the abundance channel. So you have to feel good. Like maybe sometimes I trigger you negatively and that's still good too. Because as long as I trigger you, as long as I get you to think, as long as I move you emotionally, my job's done. So from my end to yours, have an amazing Friday. Remember, show up. Don't worry about getting it right or being perfect. Just be you. No one can mess with your truth. No one can mess with you if you're authentically yourself. And really, I encourage you to be unapologetically, authentically you and show up every day without fail. It doesn't matter if it takes half an hour. It doesn't matter if it takes 10 hours or 12 hours. That is up to you. But I give yourself the gift to show up because if you're here to create massive impact, if you're here to create massive influence, you're here to create massive income and you want to create your own freedom life by design, you have to be willing to show up without fail every day. That is my opinion. You know what? Take it or leave it. I'm sending you much love and uh, have an amazing Friday wherever you are in the world. Would love to hear your feedback, of course. Hang out with me in my Facebook group, Soul Boss Queens on the Rise. And of course, if there's anything I can do to assist you, to work through some inner blocks, some traumas, some mindset shifts to help you elevate and expand so you can embody this next level soul boss queen that's already inside of you, that sovereign woman ready to come out, then you send me a message and we will see what's in alignment for both of us together right now. Um, and that's it from my end. Much love to you. I'm off to the beach now because hashtag I can.